So we're taking the monorail over to Epcot for our first day of food and wine. We are in Epcot, it was a mess. There's a lot of people, lines are crazy. They need to get extra machines like Universal because A, they're looking, A, we had to go through the transportation, transportation and ticket center one and then we had to do it again because Epcot doesn't have the difference. So we had to do it twice and it was, it was crazy here in Epcot. Too many lines not able to look through fast enough. It was it was a mess. It's officially food and wine. Signs are out. Today is the first day we are in. Got our book. We are ready. Made a fast pass as we were walking in for Space Shipper. Creating the future, shall we? On your computer screen, answer a few questions for us. Then we'll show you a new world, custom made just for you. There's a sign right by the fountains for Taste Epcot for the Festival Center. This away. In front of Mouse Gears, they have another sign for the Festival Center telling you to go this way. Another two signs for the Festival Center. One right as you're about to turn, sign straight ahead. Then you have Remy with another arrow pointing to the Festival Center. And then the Festival Center sign right up front. We got this one, like a glass of wine and cheese, and then another one right up the walkway. They've been fixing up the outside of the building. Sign when you walk in is filled with leaves. It's a pretty good wall during food and wine. This area used to always be empty when we walked in. Maybe because there are a million signs out this year. Everyone knows it's over here. Or it's because it's the first day. Yeah. Possibly yeah. both. I think, I, I think that's what it is. Uh, I think it's both. Bradley and Pa are sitting watching some, some little video. Not 100% sure what it is, honestly. Oh, it's about coffee. So this year, to get your pass holder magnet, it's in the festival center. So we're gonna head and get it. So during your first visit of food and wine, if you're a pass holder, you can pick up your pass holder magnet. First time you're able to. So it's first time we got it. After your fourth visit, you get a cutting board. So we have a week to get that, and we really want that. So this is super cute. Mickey with a chip hat. Heading into the Girardelli section to see the chocolate art. Mom got her usual chocolate shot, basically. And it is just the light. pure. The only type of pure. shot mom will take. Yes, true. You, you're, you got that right. Thing. So they also have vendors that are around, and that's the Cutco vendor for the knives, and it's mom's favorite knives. Beautiful, very sharp. Never go down. A plus Cutco. Have brews around the world. Lots of merch. Has some signs. And once again, if you want to have a gift card keychain, they're selling them. They have really cute Remy ones. I think I like this one with the cheese. Oh, this one's cute too. They're all cute. What am I saying? Don't worry, I'll get one. <laughs> and then this is always a fan fave. It is basically a plate and a cup holder, so that way when you're eating around, because it's so large to find tables, you'll have a plate and somewhere to put your drink. This line out here is just to buy what you were shopping for. This is just to purchase. This is where they have all the seminars back here. One is going on right now. Kristen stopped at Shimmering Sips at the Festival Center and got a tropical mimosa. Is it yummy? Very yummy. Six dollars. Not bad. Over in between Mouse Gear and Test Track they have a little playground for the kiddos. 
It's called the Family Play Zone, presented by Ralph Breaks the Internet. How was that? How was that peanut butter sandwich you just had? So delicious. So delicious. Wow. Bradley is learning the vlogging ways. He just had a peanut butter sandwich that we brought for him, and he kept saying, "Camera, camera." He wanted me to videotape his reaction. Mickey's barbecuing, and we don't know if we should go left or right. Bradley, which way? Bradley, Bradley said. Bradley said, "Let's go left." So we're going left. First stop, Islands of the Caribbean. So I stopped at Islands of the Caribbean to get an empanada, and it's actually a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be, and it was 5.25. There's the inside. Need some Tabasco yeah. sauce. But I don't know how you. I don't know how you complete it. What do you have to do to complete you have to it? To find all the remedies and put their stuff on that. Oh. I, I thought you were gonna put it the hand sauce on all put, of it. Yeah. it on. You could. Like it? Oh yes, I do. Oh yeah. I didn't know you were like looking at me. You're looking at you. Crazy girl. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, let's go. Daisy is out meeting and greeting, and she's got an adorable like chef outfit on. Looks like she's making pies. Oh my, that's so cute. Next spoon is grease. Yeah. One and one. Yeah. Or too much. Or does mom want? Uh, you want to eat here? Please. That's the menu. Stop three is Thailand. Next stop, Mexico. Okay. Mom stopped at Mexico, and what'd you get? Okay. Coconut rice pudding. Hmm. Let's see. We're gonna get out. Really good. I love rice pudding, and I love coconut. So, really can't go wrong. Next stop, China. It's India. Where's it? Africa. Stop to Africa. What'd you get? The beef beef, tip. ten beef tips. I don't know what the white stuff is. Doesn't look like mashed potatoes. So no. I have no idea. Cauliflower? No, it's blue. So what Ooh, is it? What's it? Woo! It's pap and it's very spicy. Oh my god. It's Africa, guys. It's very, very spicy. Come here. Let's try it. Germany. Stop 
stopped in Italy and we got the rigatoni. And Dad got his. And Kristen got. What do you want? Uh, frito misto. And a margarita. 